all right guys welcome back to the channel today in the garage we have another bronco this time a soft top and we're going to be in draw installing the hydraulic shock that goes between the top of the bronco and the convertible top so we're going to go ahead and get into this the first step we need to do is install a nut into that factory hole right there so i'm going to go ahead and get the hardware and we're going to go ahead and install that all right, so we're gonna install the first piece of hardware here. This is item number three on the instructions. Basically gonna use the shock uh, nut here, flat washer, lock washer, and nut. And this is gonna go on the inside, just like this. Make sure that you don't uh, drop that down inside of any of the fenders. So we're just gonna make this hand tight for now and it calls for a 12 millimeter wrench. So we're gonna go ahead and install the next bracket. If you'll just follow the nylon strap for the soft top, go directly above, and about a half inch above the strap, you'll have a T30 nut right here. We're gonna go ahead and take that one out. That was just a clicking in. Okay, here's where we're going to mount the insert for the bracket. We're going to take this factory nut out. Again, this is a T30. We've already taken the T30 out of the top. This is going to set inside like so. And then we're going to put the factory T30 nuts right back in their spots. No one will. All right, as you can see, we have the bracket mounted where the nylon strap is. You'll want to take that T30 out and then there's a T30 right here and then the bracket slides under that. You physically have to take this nut out. Um, this did give me the most trouble. I uh, probably worked on this for 10 or 15 minutes trying to get that one in but this bracket slides left to right. So take your time, hold the bracket right here and adjust it and you'll get that in. Moving on to the next section, we're going to go ahead and put the lower strut nut um, into the bracket that we just installed. As you can see, the bracket is tapered towards the inside of the Bronco. All right, so we have the top strut on. What we did was we went ahead and opened the trunk uh, all the way up. It's going to feel like it's going to limit out, but right at that limit point is where you'll be able to snap that onto that strut. So there's plenty of clearance down the side, plus you have the strut bolt down there at the bottom. Now we did test this a few times. You wanna show them how, how that works? All right, so up it goes by itself and now we're gonna work on the passenger side. It is a little firmer to close, but it will latch. All right, here we go. We got the lower bracket installed on each side. Now, the, we didn't have to drill any types of holes. Uh, these are the factory holes in the soft top. Uh, so we got the lower shock strut um, tower, if you wanna call it, um, mounted and secured with uh, two 12 millimeter ratchets. All right, we got it all wrapped up. Uh, as you can see, it is holding up without the hood strut uh, bar kickstand. So we're gonna go ahead and close this and show you how tight it fits. So nice and solid. Straps are tight now. There's no slack in here. It's one thing that we noticed. If you like this product, uh, check out the description. I'll put the link down below. And as always, uh, thank you for tuning into the channel. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe and share our content. We'll see you on the next one.